Welcome to another Muda video and in today's video we're going to define DeFi, Decentralized Finance. But before we begin, make sure to give us a like on this video if you enjoy the content and subscribe to our channel. Uh, leave a comment down below to let us know which other topics you'd like to learn. Muda.exchange is now live trading the top cryptocurrencies as the easiest way to send, receive, buy and sell cryptocurrency on the continent. Let's get into the video. So what is DeFi, decentralized finance? We would define it as a new movement because uh, if you look at what decentralized finance has always been, we can go back in time until we look at barter trade. It has always been a decentralized finance. Even, even if you take money out of the bank and you're paying someone else, decentrally, <laughs> you are making a payment. So DeFi is a movement into this new mode walking away from the traditional finance and i just wanted to make this video to explain what are the key differences between the current traditional finance system and the DeFi system that everyone is making uh, their life about in the crypto space so DeFi is a new financial movement that is open to everyone across the globe decentralized and is almost or entirely governed by smart contracts and the blockchain technology in the DeFi space, we can say some of the biggest DeFi projects have been on the Ethereum blockchain and some more are being built on the Bitcoin blockchain. But all in all, it is an open, inclusive, non-governable, no government in the world can shut it down and no one can refuse you from participating in it. This is what makes DeFi special. But let's get into some examples of how DeFi is being used. One of the first projects in the DeFi space that sort of had an inclination to the tradition of finance was the MakerDAO project that was started in 2015. And you could lock collateral, that is assets, and then that collateral is used to generate DAI. DAI is a cryptocurrency stable coin that is pegged to the US dollar. And so people were using this MakerDAO to save and also lend and also borrow money from this project. You can always search out this project on Google. So some of the key important parts of DeFi are some of the projects that we have talked about on our page here. By the way, subscribe to our YouTube channel if you're watching and enjoying the content. Make sure you subscribe and you can leave a comment, let us know what you'd love to learn next. But some of the important parts of DeFi include DEXs, those are decentralized exchanges. We have derivatives. These are some of the projects that are taking real world assets and tracking them using the blockchain, which you can invest in. We have margin trading. Uh, this you can do it even on the Muda exchange, where you're looking for arbitrage in the differences between the different asset prices. And then we can also have insurance, we can also have lending and borrowing, and also stable coins. These different parts make up this whole thing we call the decentralized finance and is open for everyone. So some of the key risks that are involved in DeFi is anonymity. <laughs> everyone, of course, prefers traditional finance right now because it is much, much easier to track your assets. If let's say you lost some of your assets, it is easier to be able to get them back. But with DeFi, yes, it's open to everyone, but that also opens up new challenges, which some we have not even talked about or tackled. I hope this video has given you a unique understanding of what DeFi is. And those of you who are in Africa, the easiest way I can explain DeFi is mobile money. In the beginning, everyone had a phone. Now money sits on everyone's phone and you can send it to your friend without having to go to a bank, without having to notify your local council authority that you are going to send uh, 100,000 uh, Ugandan shillings to someone else. So it gives an example of what is possible in DeFi and we are so happy to be some of the pioneering people when it comes to DeFi on the continent and bringing these services closer to the unbanked people of Africa. So thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, if you like this com content, give us a like on our YouTube channel. Uh, make sure to leave a comment. Let us know what you'd like to learn next. Uh, and then the Munda.exchange is live. The easiest way to send and receive, buy and sell cryptocurrencies or various currencies as we are adding them on to the platform so make sure you check it out kyc after kyc you can get some free crypto for you to trade thank you so much for watching this video and i will see you in the next one cheers